Okay, everybody, stand up, do it. Good morning, students. How are you today? I'm Thank you. Well, I'm very excited because today we have a very important class. So sit down. Merry Christmas. Today is Christmas Eve and tomorrow is Christmas Day, right? Yes! In some countries, some people really celebrate Christmas, right? Yes! Okay, well, today we have something important to talk about. Today we're going to talk about future tense, okay? Yes! Also, we will talk about space on page 68 and 70, okay? Pages 68 and 70. Please open your books to page 68. Read after me. Are you ready? Yes! I'm not ready. Okay, here we go. Hotels on the moon. Do you want to spend your holidays in hotels on the moon? Do you want to spend your holidays in hotels on the moon? At the moment, there are no hotels on the moon. But all this will change. If we can solve some problems, we will be able to build. If we can solve some problems, we will be able to build hotels here in the future. Go. The moon is very cold. So the hotels will have to be warm. They will also need a large amount of air so the people there can breathe. The hotels on the moon will have rooms with big windows so that you can see the earth. You will be able to swim in the hotel swimming pool and see all the stars around you. But you should not get too excited. A trip to the moon will cost a lot of money. 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 Should we need to? Oh, Abuela, do we? Okay, I'm so happy to talk about page 68 today. Does anybody know what happened on Monday? Or the day before yesterday, on Tuesday, do you know what happened? Do you know SpaceX? Oh, yes, yes. Okay. Just raise your hand if you hear SpaceX before. Raise your hand if you ever heard of SpaceX before. Raise your hand if you ever heard of Elon Musk. Tesla. Well, today, it's okay. Today we're going to talk about future tense, okay? okay? Let's talk about future tense. What is future tense? Remember the song we learned last week? Well, we're going to sing that song later, but first, let's do some future tense sentences. If you fly on an airplane, you will buy a ticket. 
Ooh. Yes or no? Yeah. Right? Yeah. Okay. If you want to throw the airplane into the rubbish bin, it will cost a lot of money, right? Yes. That is a shio, yo, yo, fiji, yo, eza, yo, fans, that lodge, yo, in the right? Right? How about if they make a new airplane? New airplane, Schmidza. If they make a new airplane for everybody who wants to fly, and you only use the airplane one time and throw the airplane away, the airplane tickets will be very expensive, right? Expensive. Like your book says on page 868, right? Trip to the moon, very expensive, right? Yes. If you want to take a train to Beijing tomorrow, and they make a new train for you, and then when you get to Beijing, you throw the train away into the rubbish bin, then the ticket for the train will be very expensive, right? Yes. You only a whole shit eats it by Raji or Higuela, right? Yeah. Very expensive, right? Yes. If your father or mother. Do you have a father or mother? Father. Yes. Yes. Drive you to school in a car and then throw the car into the rubbish bin every day after they drive you to school, then school will be very <laughs> and very expensive, right? School bus. If you take the school bus to school and you will throw and then you will throw the school bus into the rubbish bin every day school will be very expensive right how real right yes Okay, okay, so big on cheap. So the planes, cars, trains, school buses, boats, ships, bikes, and big on cheap. If everything you must throw in the rubbish bin after one time, then then what? Then mom one, right? Yeah. Can, if can everybody fly? Can everybody fly if the airplane ticket is so expensive? No. no. Nobody can fly. Can everybody travel? Yo, yo, my gohocha. Buy a new car every day. Buy, no. No, no travel, right? Yes. Can everybody go to school? No. no. Yo, my don't you? If you go shopping. Your might don't your might wiring don't she if you buy something from another country it could be so expensive too, right? Yes. yes. No shopping, no school. So Will we learn about other places? No. No. Will we have a new technology? No. no. Can we drive a school bus no. to space? No. Can we fly an airplane to space? No. Yes or no? No. Take a train? No. How do we go to space, class? Walk. Walk. By rockets? Yes. Ah, on page 
page 68 in your book, it talks about a space hotel, right? We cannot walk to a space hotel, right? Do you know what the first year we went to the moon was? No. Do you know what year? 1974. Yes or no? Yes. yes. 2000, right? No, who said 1984? What? Nobody knows? Yes. Very good. 1969. 1969, right? A human. Do you know his name? A human named Neil Armstrong. Armstrong. A human named Neil Armstrong. The first human to go to the moon, right? Yes. For all humans, we were very excited, right? Very, I'm very hungry now. Too. Very, very proud, right? Good job, humans, right? From 1969, until 2015. Today, right? Yes. Why well, should travel about 2016, right? Yes. We go, we go to space, and we will go to space. <laughs> A lot, right? Yes. We know how to use rockets, right? Yes. We will future tense, right? Yes. We will use rockets to put people into space, right? Yes. We will use rockets to put ice cream into space, right? Yes. No. We will use robots, right? Yes. Yo, how no don't she, right? Yes. We will put many things into space. Right? Yes. Everybody can go to space. Because it is very cheap, right? Yes. No. 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 Yes or no? No. no. We, we will learn a lot about space quickly because it is so cheap and easy to go to space, right? No! 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 Do you know what we do, students? Today, we go to space with a spaceship and Five, four, three, two, one. The spaceship goes into space. 
And the little capsule goes into space, right? Yes. yes. And what do we do with the space with the rocket? <laughs> Playing. We throw it away, right? Yes. Well, young, young eats it. We use it one time and throw it away, right? Yes. <laughs> what is more expensive? <laughs> A rocket or a bike? Rocket. Rocket. Rocket or a bike? Rocket? Rocket. Rocket or a car? Rocket. Rocket or a train? Rocket. Or a bus? School bus? Rocket. How about a plane? Rocket. Rocket. A rocket. So a rocket, right? Yes. One rocket can buy one hundred planes, right? Yes. yes. So today, nobody goes to space, right? Yes. Only a little bit of people go, right? Yes. It's so expensive. We have a problem, right? Yes. yes. What is the problem? Uh, the problem is rockets are too expensive because we only use them once and then throw away. I have a surprise for you. On two, in 1969, humans did something that would change the future. Yes. Right? Yes. yes. They went to the moon. On Tuesday... Humans did something new. On Tuesday, we did something that is going to change your future for all humans. Every classroom all over the world every newspaper every TV every language All people were celebrating our great achievement. We did something great, students and your teachers. I don't know why. They did not tell you. While you were in school on Tuesday, something happened. A man named Ellen Musk. A man, he was a student. When he was a student in school, he had an idea. He said, look it, a long time ago, people, we leave the oceans, and we live on the land, and that was really good. 
He said, I want to help people on earth. I want to go to Mars. And everybody laughed at him and said, Ah, you cannot go to Mars. So he said, Ah, I will make a business on the internet. I will make a lot of money. He got the money on the internet. He says, I will take the money. And he says, Oh, but you'll shout him off on a little problem. We cannot go to Mars today because it's too expensive. We must make going to space very easy. So I will do that first. And then I will go to Mars because look at what happened to the dinosaurs. Do you see any dinosaurs? Yes. He said, we must leave Earth to go to other planets. We must do something great. I want to help humans do something great. So I will make a company. I will make a rocket company called SpaceX. And everybody said, oh, ho, 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 little boy, you cannot make a rocket company. And he said, yes, I can. And 13 years ago, he got his first rockets. And he said, I will make a rocket. Go to space and come back. Wow. I will not throw it away. Wow. wow. And everybody laughed and said, oh. <laughs> so, he did what he said. Six months ago, little problem. It did not work. Let me show you what happened on Tuesday. Are you ready? Yes. yes. Let me show you something magic. And you can go home and teach your mothers and your fathers. And you can go to your science class and teach your teachers. Because right now, students, it is not expensive to go to space anymore. Right now, when you go to university, you can do Lots of things. You could do things before that you had to have lots of money for. You can now, in the future, you can go to space. There will be new jobs for you that we do not have today. When I was a student, we were throwing the rockets away. We were throwing the airplanes today away. When you're a student... You can do lots of things what I cannot do. I'm too old now. The future is now for you. You will have a different future than what I had. I'm so excited to show you. But before you have that future, you have to know what's going to happen. And you have to know what to dream about. And today, students, it's not a dream. Today, it's real. Let's watch. Uh, it's actually a okay. super complicated thing. Like you did some Can you see? cool analogies, cool math to figure this out. Right? <laughs> this is a SpaceX. I crunched the numbers with the For the first time, all the people in the world are watching to see if it would work while you were in school. And land on a shoebox on the ground in a waste. That's that's the nice critical point. There's a window so they can see. Over the Empire State Building, and we're like three seconds away from this. See that? Energetic from this. Ready? Here comes the rocket. It's put 11 satellites in space. Now it's coming down now. The first time. Let me tell you something.
something fast. The time is 9 a.m. This is not America. This is not what... When we have one airplane that can fly around the world and we don't throw the airplane away, not one country has an airplane. Every country has an airplane, right? Yeah. Not one student can go to school when you can use a school bus and not throw it away. Every student could go, right? This new invention to use a rocket, this is for everybody on the earth. This is for you. So when your book that you're learning says nothing about what's real, about space hotels on the moon costing a lot of money, well, now, students, if you want to make a rocket, you know gas in Sao Chio, you'll put the gas in the rocket. The rocket uses oxygen. You know oxygen? Yeah. It's more little money for the gas in the rocket to go to space than it is to buy gas to go from Guangzhou to Beijing on an airplane. We can now use the rocket and the rocket can come back and we could put air in it, oxygen. We could use it again and again and again. Now tickets are not expensive. Yes. Now they are cheap. Yeah. And now, now we don't have to go to the moon, students. What can we do in the future now? Let's talk about future tense. Now that it's cheap to go to space, where can we go? Mars. That's right. We can go to Mars, students. Yes. We could go... What moons have water? Do you know where the water is? Do you know there's a big planet with rings? Saturn. Oh. Yeah. Do you know some moons in Saturn have more water than all the water on the Earth's oceans? Yes. Do you know that there's companies that want to make medicine, you know medicine? Yes. That can help people on earth, do you know that? Yeah. But some medicine, it's very hard to make where you have, what's this? Gravity, right? Yes. So they want to go to space to make medicine, but they cannot go to space to make medicine because before it was so expensive to buy a rocket, right? Yeah. Now that it's so cheap, what can we do? They can go to space and make medicine for very little money, right? Yeah. Students, before, if the airplane ticket is so expensive, nobody can fly, right? Yes. Now that everybody can fly, everybody can travel, our technology will be very fast, right? Yes. There will be new jobs, future tents. Mm -hmm. There will be new things. There will be new dreams. What do you dream about? Before, when you dream, everybody says, oh, don't dream about a rocket. That's too much money. Even the book says you should not get too excited a trip to the moon will cost a lot of money. Well, you know what? Today, this book is wrong. I want you to be very excited. And you are the first people in seventh grade. It is your job to make dreams what I could not dream and your mother and father could not dream because all we know is expensive rockets. Now you know cheap rockets. In five years, you will be in university with the first new rockets. You will be the first ones on those rockets. You have to start dreaming right now. Don't follow this book that tells you don't get excited. 
No, 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 no. After Tuesday, you need to get very excited. You need to teach your teachers because even your Chinese teachers, they don't know what happened. Because your newspapers in China, they don't say anything about it. Yes. The book says, don't be excited. I'm sorry. Are you a Chinese student? Are, are you a human student? Right? Yes. Neil Armstrong did not go to the moon as an American. He went to the moon as humans, right? Yes. And you are the humans for tomorrow. Tomorrow's students are different than the students that read this book when we throw rockets away, right? Yeah. Yeah. It's time for a new book, right? Yeah. Do you want to watch this one more time before our class is finished? Yeah. Yes. yes. Okay, let's close the windows. Let's watch one more time this great event, all right? Here we go. Good job. All right, here he goes. Actually, a super complicated thing. Like you did some Such a cool beautiful thing. Math to figure this out, right? We did not see the Armstrong. We were not alive. We can see this. This is our time now. This is your time. Are you ready? Having it reverse, come back down and land on a shoebox on the ground in a waste. That's, that's the, the, the critical part. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I have to throw a pencil over the 